guys my name is Kawi and welcome to my first tour around Cape Town please remember to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel at the back of your brochure mm -hmm. those are your tickets mm -hmm. so you can scan this mm -hmm. when you scan this it's gonna pop up a map like that mm -hmm. and then you can live drag the buses oh, yeah. so the numbers are the stops you will see as you go out that's where the bus is going to pick you up again. Oh, okay. Enjoy, Nick. Thank, Thank you. you. Great pleasure. Thank you. Hello, ma. Hey, everybody. Welcome to Cape Town. Today is the first day that I'm going to explore, or we're going to explore the city on this red bus right here. It's a Hope on Hope on. So, Hope on Hope on bus. This is their office right here. Today it's a little bit chilly. We came in the winter season. Bus. They you pay 275 rand. I'm not sure how much that is in, in dollars, but uh, it's a good option because you get to see different places. They have different stops. You can get off, hop on, hop off. You got a problem, they don't mind. Um, it's really beautiful. I think it's actually free here when it's very, very sunny. But again, we have to do this because we don't have like a lot of time to wait for the sun. So. And then you get, you have a map here. So there's a red one and there's a blue one. So you, you see the places? So yeah, the bus will be here in 20 minutes. So we're just gonna wait and then hop on. For the city sightseeing buses, there are two options for the same route and the same price. The difference is that there's a red line and a blue line. The red line bus does not stop at any point and the blue line bus stops at different places where you hop off, see what you're going to see and explore the place that you want to explore and then hop on again when the next bus comes. For this bus right here, it's a red lot as you can see, so it's not going to stop at any point or maybe it stops at different specific points. As cold as it was, I decided to go to the top part of the bus to cut the best views of the city because this is once in a lifetime kind of thing. When you get on the bus, um, at the office they give you these earphones to listen. So they don't have like a guide, so you just listen. These are like the ports right here, so I'll connect this. This audio is so helpful considering the fact that there's no guide to explain what's going on. The audio is in different languages with that you can get to know where you are the history of each place and stop there is for us we took the blue bus and explore so that we could stop at different places and our first stop would be christian Roach, a botanical garden The beauty about this bus, you get a chance to experience Cape Town in all its glory for only 275 rands or 2,000 Kenya shillings or $14 for 24 hours. That's one day. you can see it's 
so we're just gonna stroll around because there are free tours but only at 10 and at 2 um, so we just have to walk right now there is an entry fee in this place of 200 runs or 1500 kenya shilling or 11 dollars once you pay that you are able to access this place you can walk all over the place without a problem it's quite big so spare some time to explore this place <laughs> this is such a beautiful place the table mountain is just like in front of me right now and there's a stream right here if you can hear the sound of the stream my goodness literally heaven on earth there's the mountain right there and then there's a small stream oh my goodness what a cute stream it is look at this the sound of nature the sound of water is so calm wow there's the mountain here we have the stone sculptures more plants whatever this is I'm not even sure If you are a nature and plants lover, Christian Birch is for you. Christian Birch was founded in 1913. It has a lot of indigenous plants and it's one of the seven best botanical gardens in the world. For me, the canopy walk stood out the most. I loved this the most. And here we are, the canopy walk. You can see the sign right here. Welcome to the Century Tree Canopy Walk. Huh? Oh. One slang. Comment warning. Okay, let's go. It's like the signature of this place. Like, if you come here, you have to come to this place. We are hoping on the second map, it's here, right here. Um, it's the blue line. So we're gonna go to Hostel. The ticket is here. So. No, it's fine, ma'am. Don't scan. My scanning machine has two X. Thank you. As we head to Health Bay, be keen on how the roads are beautiful and also the surroundings. On your way to Health Bay, there's one stop that I would have loved to hope for, but because of time, it was impossible. It's called Inizamoyetu. It's an informal settlement in Hout Bay area. The history of this place is really interesting. One needs a local guide. It's really beautiful and highly recommended. Okay. This is our second spot after Christian Boat. It's called Hout Bay. Such a beautiful place. So we're gonna be walking around and just see what they have. It's a beach, there's a beach. I think we should just walk like this first. Wow. Here in Hout Bay, there's a little bit of everything, fish market, curio shop, hotels and everything. is literally surrounded by mountains as you can see mountains 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 all over hey Phil 
Hey! This is a seal. How are you? And yes, I saw a seal in Houtsway for the first time and I was really excited about it because it was a new experience for me. Wait, wait, only when I say yes. When I say no, you're not going to take it. No, no, yes. Oh. Hey. <laughs> can she do that? She can feed him as well, but only when I say I'm going to take it. Okay? So I'm gonna say to you, no. Wait, show it to him, show it to him. No, no, no. Show it to him, show it to him. Hey. Okay. Wait, no. keep it, just keep it slow. Only when I say yes. Yes. No. Yeah. Hopefully, <laughs> Cape Town is one of the busiest fishing harbors in Western Cape with an establishment of tuna and crayfish industry. This is one of the reasons why it's really famous. One of the things that makes it really beautiful is the mountains surrounding the area. From Hots Bay, we hoped on a game in the bus, hoping to hope off at Camps Bay. We are in Cape Bay, we didn't stop right there. It's really cold because of the wind and the... Yeah, because of the wind and it's winter still. But the views are spectacular in every way. As it was so cold and getting late, for the rest of the evening we enjoyed the scenic views, the beautiful sunsets and the incredible posh real estates of Cape Town. The sunset was really beautiful, I could not get enough of it. This beautiful area right here is called Sea Point and it's one of the places where you can also visit but we are very lucky to be staying here. There are a few stops here where you can stop and hop off and uh, we're gonna be stopping in the next I hope you loved the video of Cape Town, my first official tour in Cape Town. Please remember to subscribe and see you in the next video of Cape Town because it's going to be interesting, amazing trip it's going to be.